Hello, this is Dr. Michael Shear with Learn Saturno, a free resource on how to market treatment plant place and maintain Saturno overdenture implants. The purpose of this YouTube video is to describe the new and exciting Saturno narrow diameter implant system. Laid out in front of you is the entire system and the components that we'll be discussing today. This is the introductory video to the Saturno implant system. Look for follow-up videos to include treatment planning and drilling sequences and placement of Saturno narrow diameter implants. First and foremost, I'm going to describe everything that you see in front of you. What we see here is, is our implant packaging very similar to what you have ex been experienced and are used to with LODI, the locator overdenture system implant. <clears throat> Indicated here we have a one-piece oball implant. This Saturno oball implant is a very nice design because it uses all of the features that we've learned to love with the Lodi system, all the implant design, with a connection that you are used to. For those OBAL users out there, you're really going to love the Saturno implant because the workflow is very similar to what you've been experiencing with your current or previous experience with OBAL implant systems. Now, introduced new to the market, specially designed by Zest Anchors for really tricky maxillary situations and other angled bone situations, is the Saturno 20 degree angled narrow diameter implant. This exciting design is also a one piece dental implant similar to the straight oval that you saw earlier, but using a 20 degree angled abutment. That abutment is also connected to the implant one piece design for simplicity. The entire packaging also comes with everything that you would need, very similar to what you've been experiencing with the Lodi system, including the housing as well as a block out spacer. Inside of the housing, there is an O-ring cap, race, and O-ring itself. That Saturno patented pivoting connection is a really wonderful design, especially for off-access implants. This is all included for one low price. For just a little bit more money, but not a significant amount more, you can get the angled Saturno narrow diameter implant. However, both of these are very appropriately uh, priced for your patients. Also included in the Saturno narrow diameter implant system is a surgical kit very similar to what you also have been experiencing or have experienced with Lodi. This all-encompassing surgical kit includes everything that you would possibly need to place and utilize a Saturno narrow diameter implant. So going through the drilling system, you can see here, just like Lodi, we have a pilot drill, which is 1.2 millimeter, a 1.6 millimeter drill, a 2.1 millimeter drill, and a 2.4 millimeter drill. Now you'll notice a couple of things that are different as well. Uh, we have our standard tissue punch and extender, like you've seen in the Lodi system. These two are used for other situations where it might be either tricky to get extension or for straight oball implants with the standard tissue punch. Now also Zest Anchors has included a 20 degree tissue punch which is essentially the tissue punch from before except a little bit wider to accommodate the angulation. Zest Anchors has decided to include all directional indicators for your Saturno narrow diameter implant placement and you can see here you have your standard straight directional indicator or you have your angled directional indicator with the angulation that's needed for uh, corresponding to your angled Saturno implant. Included in each surgical kit is four of the straight and four of the angled, making for very nice surgical simplicity. Now you'll notice here that we have a torque wrench. The torque wrench is also similar to what you've seen with Lodi. However, all you get is the torque wrench because the Saturno attachment is very straightforward and you don't need a core tool. Obviously, that core tool was designed for locator. This is a torque wrench that also includes the insert to utilize any of the driver tips specifically designed for Saturno. So you'll also notice that we have the included drill stops. We have five of them of different diameters and lengths. And you see here that we have a six millimeter length, eight, 10, 12, and 14. 
And now all of these drill stops will snap on easily onto each one of the drill diameters, making for easy interchangeability. So if I was placing a 12 millimeter Saturno narrow diameter implant, I can take the 12 millimeter drill stop and put it on all four of my um, osteotomy burrs if I needed to. Additionally, you'll notice here that for your straight Saturno narrow diameter implants, we have an ISO latch driver that'll go into your handpiece. And then also for the manual insertion of the straight um, Saturno implants, we have the driver that goes into the manual torque wrench. Now we also have a direct driver. The direct driver is used for finite and very detailed positioning of your angled Saturno implant. Now that describes our surgical kit. I'll put that aside. What I'd like to show you is the essentials of the Saturno narrow diameter implant and why this is a really exciting and innovative design. This is the Zest Anchor Saturno demonstration model for the Saturno implant. And you can see here that we have a maxillary arch or an upper arch with four of the angled implants and two of the straight implants. And you can see here what really makes it exciting is, is in those maxillary ridge situations, we notice that a lot of times the maxillary anterior ridge sometimes slopes just like this. Where in the posterior ridge, a lot of times we have straight bone. Now additionally, we have some sinus cavity space that exists up in here. But for the most part, sometimes our biggest challenge with maxillary cases is those angled anterior ridges. And when we utilize that with existing oball implant designs, we're essentially drilling straight, hopefully making sure that we have a proper long access path of insertion, and then also not perforating the anterior portion of the bone. Now, Zest Anchors has recognized the limitation of some of the other straight O-ball implant systems on the market, and they've decided to design this uh, innovative angled Saturno design. And it's specifically indicated for those tricky situations in the maxillary anterior, like in these one, two, three, four areas. And what's nice about that is, is that as I zoom in just a little bit to show you, you can see here that it creates a very nice path of insertion for your prosthesis. Right in here, that singular long access path of insertion makes for easy insertion and removal of our complete denture, as you see here. Really providing for optimal resistance to anterior posterior rocking as well as lateral rocking. Now the Saturno O-ball connection allows for a pivoting design of that internal portion of the Saturno. If I grabbed an instrument just to show you what I mean and bring this a little bit closer, you'll notice here that this internal portion will pivot, allowing for maximum insertion of the angulation of our implants. And right in here, this one probably pivots the most on this model. There you go. And I can show you here on a fresh Saturno attachment. This one right here hasn't been processed. And if you notice here, how extreme that pivot can be. And this pivot really allows for those off axis situations where we have a devil of a time trying to get a long axis insertion of a standard O-ball housing. Now ultimately Zest Anchor's opinion and their feeling about having this patented design is the simple fact of the matter is, is that if we can have a pivoting internal design with the Saturno connection, it's gonna lead to less attachment wear, which has really been proven. So looking at that, how it applies to this model, you can see here when I insert that onto my patient and onto the model, there is a slight amount of pivot that occurs with each one of those Saturnos as it seats, providing for really nice ease of insertion plus low maintenance. And what's nice is, is if we go through some of the catalog in the manual, you'll notice here that the Zest Anchors Company has really designed a new angle and narrow diameter implants, and it really gives you a case for changing your point of view. Because, as Zest Anchors is the trusted manufacturer of the locator attachment, the Saturno attachment is really a natural segue for many of you O-ball users. And I understand an O-ball connection is very straightforward, very simple, and tolerated very well by a lot of patients. 
And with this really wonderful one-piece design of the Saturno implant, you notice here that you have this proven RBM surface, this moderately roughened surface, just like the Lodi implant, with the aggressive apical portion, allowing you to internally tap that implant and allows it to enhance the primary stability of the insertion of the implant. And it's really fabulous because you know that in your traditional oval implants, you're really limited to the amount of angulation that you can um, accommodate. Where with the Saturno narrow diameter implant, you know especially with those angled implants, that, that exciting new angled implant, it really permits for some pretty neat uses. And because we're using one of those really nice designs like the Lodi implant, we know that it has a really proven design. That aggressive nature of the thread really en enhances the primer stability, where this traditional design with these very small threads really doesn't allow for really great primary stability. So just to show you again with the Saturno versus some of the existing Obol connections, we know that the Saturno really allows for maximum angulation correction for those really tricky situations enhance wear resistance as well. As I mentioned before, the all-in-one packaging is really exciting because it really allows for maximum versatility with minimal cost investment. And you notice that we have three different diameters now as opposed to just the two diameters with the Lodi system. The exciting new 2.0 millimeter diameter for the Saturno implant is very exciting. The angled implant is available in the 2.0 2.4 or the 2.9 diameters. Additionally, you can have your choice of two or four millimeter cuff heights with all of them. Included in all of the packaging is your O-ring assembly housing, and additionally, like I mentioned before, the blockout spacer. So this has been another edition of Learn Saturno. I certainly hope this has been an interesting and educational experience for you about specifically the Saturno implant. Um, as I mentioned before, the Saturno implant is an exciting design because as we open up some of the packaging, you'll notice inside of here, if we look at the angled implant, it's also included in one of these nice sterile containers. As I open it up, it allows for easy insertion of the implant. Let me go ahead and zoom in a little bit just to show you what that looks like. And you can see here the implant itself. If I remove it, it's on there a little bit tricky. There we go. The one-piece design really allows for a tremendous amount of flexibility. So that angled component is really pretty exciting. And for those situations where you would want a straight implant, we'll open up our packaging here for our straight implant and show you what's included. Opening up our packaging, pulling out our implant. And in this case, we have a ISO latch driver, whether we choose to do an insertion manually or with a handpiece for the straight implant, as you see right here. Included with every Saturno implant, you'll notice here within our packaging is a little sticky note that you can put in your patient's chart indicating the lot and reference number for their records. An instruction manual, just including all of the information that I described in this video, plus some additional details. And finally, everything that you would need to connect that Saturno narrow diameter implant into your complete denture, including our Saturno implant housing, and sometimes those are tricky to remove. See if I can pop out the little processing spacer. There we go. And there's our little processing O-ring. So looking at the Saturno implant, as I mentioned before, it's really a very exciting design because it allows for really unique applications in the anterior maxilla tilted implant protocol for maximizing the amount of overdenture retention in compromised sites. This has been Dr. Michael Shear with Learn Saturno, a free resource on how to market treatment plan place and maintain Saturno overdenture implants. Stay tuned for additional videos describing the surgical technique of the Saturno implant system.